Okay, welcome. So the process here, uh, we did a quick rough today. This is kind of what we came up with. Um, my team and I, you know, in one day turn around, we take a look at the lot, we look at where the views are, and we pay close attention, of course, to where the, you know, where, where the road or the garage is going to um, uh, be located in reference then to the views and then where you want your master bedroom uh, for obviously privacy, but obviously to take in, uh, you know, the, the different amenities that that lot or that area has. In this case, we have the views all uh, to the south. So this would be, well, facing south and then your views of the golf course uh, would be here and then Sopris to the south. Uh, we do start off, the, the floor plan start off real rough. So this is a rough set here. Uh, just coming up with some ideas. Uh, here's the second floor above the garage. We have a bedroom, a little ADU or a mother-in-law. And then on the other wing above uh, the rec room, of course, we have a, a two, two guest bedrooms and a bath. Uh, we like this all one big open area here, kitchen, dining, uh, bifolding or accordion door systems to walk out onto a beautiful patio, which views the golf course and then uh, the views of Sopris. Uh, the entry, breezeway, den and office, all here for those people who want to work at home, uh, also for convenience. And then so those are some ideas that we came up with today. Uh, this is how they start out. So one of our projects we're currently on, uh, you know, this was the first day draw. Then, of course, that uh, progresses. This was the first uh, round of mock-ups, you know, real rough. And then they go into, you know, a professional set of drawings, you know, making them uh, very detailed and oriented. And that goes into, of course, our structural and our uh, three-dimensional models. And then, of course, we go into our, uh, you know, final renderings. Uh, so that we have a really good visual and a really good idea of what those finishes will look like, how appealing it is, etc. So this is how it'll finish out. Uh, this is another project, like I said, we have uh, up in Snowmass. But uh, for the day, uh, this is what we have. You know, we came up with some good ideas, I think, with our team. Uh, now what we'll do is we'll go out, we'll stake the property, we'll walk the property, um, with regard to the different locations, where the views are, where the windows are placed, how the bedrooms are um, oriented throughout the floor plan, where the garage goes, etc. Uh, so this is pretty rough. We have a lot of red lines to go, but I hope this kind of gives you an idea of our process. And uh, next what we will do is we're going to be refining this quite a bit. We need that other stack for the other wing. Um, but I really do like this design. I'm thinking this design spun a little bit for the Crystal River lot, and then for the uh, the other lot, it would be something like this, but spun uh, maybe long ways down this way. So I'm, I'm thinking we could twist this out a little bit instead of having the wing kind of form a, a reverse C here, maybe have it reverse there a little bit into almost an S configuration. So that's what we've come up with um, moving forward. That is our process, we go out, uh, we do a real rough set, and then we um, we start to redline it, and then of course that um, that system, uh, you know, it takes a week or two, and we get to our uh, kind of our final set of renderings, our drawings, and our final set of redlines, which really brings it all together. So I think we have a good start on it. I'm really excited about uh, some of the finishes uh, that we're proposing, including the blue pine. Uh, but this is a great process. We have a great team, and um, I think we have a good start on this project. As with all projects, the very beginning, getting that, uh, getting an idea and a feel for the property, always pleasant. So next step, we'll go through red lines and have a set of working plans uh, to view.